Hi guys, today I wanted to show you my newborn cloth diaper stash. My hair looks really, really crazy right now. Um, so I don't have a ton of newborn diapers because she's not going to be wearing them for very long. And so as of right now, all I'm doing is just kind of stocking up for her for when she goes out of them because I think her and my son will probably be in diapers at the same time when she grows out of newborn diapers still. So I'm kind of hoping she's kind of on the smaller side. I'm hoping that she's closer to like my son with seven pounds, six ounces. So that's pretty average and ideal. And um, that'd be perfect for like newborn cloth diapers. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you all what I got. And yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna start with over here. This is just what's gonna be in her drawer. This right here is gonna have, um, all it is is just an old wipes case. I have the top of it inside the thing already. Um, inside the dresser just sitting out so I'm just gonna keep it with the lid off and this just kind of has the instructions to the wipe warmer there which I got from my baby shower and it has like the cord and then there's some little safety pins and some lotion and I'll probably end up putting some coconut oil or cloth diaper safe stuff in here and we're just gonna fill this up with um, like just water for now okay so this is all my wipes, they are all homemade. I made them all. Aren't they cute? So I have them all ready in here. This is this one's kind of smaller. This one actually doesn't need to be in there because it's more for like a face wipe. It's really, really soft. And like somebody gave me a whole bunch of flannel blankets that were used already. And so I did cut them up and use them for wipes because I needed some more. Um, and I will, I am still making more in the process, but this is just what I have here really really cute and they're really soft just made out of double um, sided flannel and so those are just going to go in there with just some warm water for when we clean her up at night and okay so these are all of my diapers I'm going to be using yep not very many um, so right here I have two Happy Heinies minis these are pocket diapers this looks really, really dark but it's like a dark purple color and this is like a lavender color. They're both with the Velcro. I wanted to get some Velcro for my husband. <laughs> so we got some of those for him. And then I have two extra small fuzzy buns. This is cotton candy and this is crushed berry color. I actually love this color a lot. I want to buy a couple more um, for her when she gets a little bit bigger. So and these are the fuzzy buns extra small pocket diapers. Here I have three Grovia, they're like a pink color all-in-one, and it has a cotton inside, and these are just so tiny and cute, ouch, I just chipped my nail, that hurts. Okay, so that's what the inside looks like. Um, I got these like for, all three of these for $15 on eBay, so... There's those, and I've got four little joeys. I got two in the brown color. These have the umbilical cord snapped down. These will be great for the first couple days. And then I got two light blue ones. I wasn't sure when I bought these if I was gonna have a boy or girl, so I tried to go gender neutral. <laughs> I was convinced that I might have a boy, so that's why I just kinda stuck with these. So I got four little joeys. These are all in ones. All these diapers are already prepped and washed, so. Here I have two fitteds. This is a Kissa Loves fitted with an vocal cord snap down. This is made by a work at home mom, I think. Um, that's her name there, Mandy's Menagerie. It's a newborn fitted diaper with the bamboo velour and the inside is so soft. It has like extra absorbency in there with the vocal cord snap down. This will probably be her first diaper that she wears hopefully so I'll go ahead and she's from hyena cart I'll go ahead and post her link down below for you guys here are two more fitted diapers these I made myself these have um, I put snaps on them and then now I don't like the snaps because it really ruined the flannel so these aren't perfect but they'll work really well for a newborn and then this one doesn't have it just has the pin and then right here I have two Thirsties Extra Small Covers. And then right over here I have 
um, a dozen newborn pre-folds, and I went ahead and embellished them all with all different kinds of fabrics. So they're really soft and extra absorbent. Here is just a inside soaker. This is a Best Bottoms small insert that can be snapped in. I only got this for like a dollar because it was like a, you know, they're just trying to get rid of stuff. So um, it's just an extra insert. And then these are just for like when if I ever run out of these and the pre-folds. These are kind of, might be kind of big on her, but these are just um, size small G diapers that I use for my son. Like one of the first diapers. These are the first diapers I ever bought. There's an orange, a red, and a green. And then these are already stuffed and ready to go in there. See? And then I have three extras here. And if if I want to, if I don't have enough covers, I can always just put pre-fold in these. And then I got two extra waterproof covers. So that is it for my newborn cloth diaper stash. It really isn't much at all because she'll be growing out of it so fast. And so um, if you guys have any questions, link them below. And... Thank you all for watching. Bye.